question eight. Which statement about the properties associated with the different types of bonding involves is correct? So let's check uh, every statement here. Okay, A. Any covalent compound that contains both oxygen and hydrogen in its molecule form hydrogen bonds. Uh, this is not true. A uh, compound like the ketone here, the propanone, uh, in this propanone, uh, there are oxygen and hydrogens. Uh, uh, in the molecule but uh, it's uh, only form the permanent dipole permanent dipole forces it cannot form hydrogen bond so a is uh, not correct b ionic bonds and covalence bond uh, cannot both occur in the same compound so this one also wrong compound like ammonium chloride okay both bonds uh, it can uh, uh, occur in the same compound the ammonium Within the ammonium, uh, there are the covalent bonds there. And between the ammonium and the chloride uh, is the ionic bonds. Right. So the B is wrong. Okay, C. Ionic compounds differ from metals uh, in that ionic compounds do not conduct electricity in the solid state. This is true because the ions are not freely moved, it cannot bring the charge. Right. So uh, C is the answer. So why D is wrong? Uh, the only covalence compound with high melting point are those uh, with uh, which uh, hydrogen bonds occur. No, uh, uh, there are those uh, compounds like diamond, uh, silicon uh, oxide, uh, which they have a giant molecular structure with the covalence bond. Right. So this one also uh, not correct. Okay. Answer. Answer confirmed is C. Okay. That's all. Thank you.